Aerospace Corporation is the largest corporate entity in existence. Originally focused on weapon and defense contracts, new ventures have expanded into biological research, space exploration, and other scientific endeavors. With unlimited funds and the ability to engage in research outside of moral and legal obligations, the UAC controls the most advanced technology ever conceived. Incoming transport detected. Mars approach, Dark Star with U07063 passing through 38000. Roger, Dark Star, descend to 2000, set speed, contact ground on 26972. Roger that tower. We have them on radar, sir. They'll be landing in a few moments. Excellent. See that Counselor Swan is sent directly to me. Yes, sir. Tower, Dark Star on final. We've got you, Dark Star. You are set for lockdown. Welcome back. I didn't want to come here. He left you no choice. True. But this is the last time. I'm tired of running damage control every time he makes a mess. Right. You're the control. And if that fails, I'm the damage. If that's what it takes, the Truger is going to start doing things our way. You say, Counselor. Welcome to Mars. All new arrivals need to check in at reception. Welcome to Mars City, Union Aerospace's premier research I facility. Get out of here. To expedite your processing, please proceed directly to reception. Welcome to Mars, Marine. I'm gonna need you to step on one of those red squares on the floor for a bio scan. This will only take a second. Okay, let me get this started. You're gonna need to hold still. Moving around only makes the test take longer. All right, bioscan looks good. You're cleared for entry. On behalf of the UAC, welcome to Mars City. This facility serves as the central hub for all scientific research, Attention. archaeological Director Banks. study, and military Please report operations. to Central Administration. Goal number one at the UAC is the safety and well-being of all employees and guests. To help achieve this goal, we ask you to follow all UAC corporate procedures at all times. This includes restricting your movement to areas for which you have clearance. Always remain alert and aware of what you and others are doing. If you notice anything out of the ordinary, or just have a simple question, Welcome to Mars. First time? You can just leave your bag there. I'll have it set up your quarters. Okay, there's a few things we need to take care of first. This is your personal data assistant. You'll need this to access all secure areas. If you get clearance for any security zones, it'll download directly. It's important, so don't lose it. I see here that Sergeant Kelly has requested your immediate attention. Head directly to Marine Command. It's just that way. Follow the signs. Mars City is a smoke-free facility. Please smoke only in designated areas. Thank you for your cooperation. I'm here because there seems to be some very serious problems. Oh, really? Do I need to remind you of the groundbreaking work that we're doing here? No, but I've been authorized by the board to look at everything. The board authorized you? Hmm. 
The board doesn't know the first thing about science. All they want is something to make them more money, some product. Don't worry, they'll get their product. After how many accidents? Tell me, Dr. Petruger, why are so many workers spooked, complaining, requesting transfers off Mars? They simply can't handle life here. They're exhausted and overworked. If I had a larger, more competent staff and bigger budget, even these few accidents could have been avoided. I'm afraid you'll get nothing more until my report is filed with the board. I will need full access, Dr. Petruga, Delta included. I won't have any difficulties doing that, will I? Only if you get lost, Swan. Just stay out of my way. Amazing things will happen here soon. You just wait. Let's go. I don't think I've seen you before. You must be a replacement for one of the guys we lost. IBM News Network, your universe now. The Human Aerospace Corporation. Miller, you hear about Corporal Allen? Yeah, they said he just lost it. Super Turbo Turkey Puncher 3. No shit. No wonder they're gonna be deprived. That's good. Is that what they're calling him now? So, tell me, just what the hell is happening over there? It's me, man. Look, all I do is repair the converters when they blow, okay? That's it. Attention, Dr. Braddock, please report to Environment Management Office for Alpha. report to Alpha. Sergeant Kelly ASAP. He's in Command HQ. This is Delta Science Management. We would like to request another security team here in Delta. Took your sweet time, Marine. Now, here's the situation. Another member of the science team's gone missing. Since you're the ranking FNG, you get to find him. I want you to check out the old decommissioned comm facility. We heard he might be heading that way. The only way there is through the service passage under Mars City. I've programmed this sentry to guide you to the maintenance elevator. I hope you follow the sentry better than you've followed orders so far. Pick up some gear at the security checkpoint at the bottom of the elevator. Oh, and when you find him, just bring him back. Do not hurt him. Now move out. Attention UAC personnel. Interested in earning more credits? Volunteer at Delta Labs today. See your service branch director for more details. Did you hear what Carter said? No, what? He said that he saw The UAC cares about the quality of life of its employees. Please take advantage of our quality medical care services.
Welcome to the dungeon, Marine. Most unexciting place on Mars. I'm gonna need you to grab some armor and secure your pistol before I can pass you through security. Okay, grab your gear. Now you're ready for combat. Let me do a radio test. Mars Sec radio check. Excellent. Good signal. Looks like you've been assigned the decommissioned comm facility. Just follow the main passage through the underground junction, then straight out. You'll have a quick evac. And what better way to see the Martian surface than to run across it? Okay, you're all set. Oh yeah, keep in mind, civilians are working down here. So don't get excited and shoot any. Oh, haven't seen anyone new down this way in quite some time. Welcome to the dungeon, brother. Enjoy your stay. Hey! You're looking for the scientist, right? I'm not sure you want to find him. You see... Uh, uh, never mind. Don't listen to me. Never mind what I said. Scotty, I've done this a million times. It's not that hard. Why don't you crawl your fat ass down here and do it yourself? Because I'm getting paid to make sure you This is Grant Baston, your environmental services supervisor. The date is October 19th. I've been hearing an alarming number of reports on some uh, unexplainable things. Being on another planet and working underground has always been a little spooky, so we always have the occasional report of strange things. But what is worrying me is the fact that the number of these reports are up by a lot. People are truly frightened. The rumors we're hearing about experiments from the Delta Complex are not helping. The power fluctuations aren't helping at all either. Having the lights flicker constantly and losing power for several minutes at a time is scaring everyone down here. I'm doing my best to keep people in track, but we're continually shorthanded. Someone's reporting in sick almost every day. I'll keep my director apprised of the situation and will continue to log reports as I get them. doesn't go all the way there. You'll have a quick walk outside to the center's airlock. Eh, hey, don't sweat it. Your suit's got plenty of oxygen. Sergeant Kelly, you need to double time it down there. Search your assigned area and haul your ass back to Mars City. Out. Huh? No, no, please. You must let me get this communication out. They have to be warned while there is still time. I can't let... I, you don't know what I've seen. You can't possibly understand or comprehend. The devil is real. I know. I built his cage. I'm getting abnormal readings here. This is bad. Oh, God! I can't hold these levels. Frozen!
All units, this is Sergeant Kelly. We're under attack by an unknown enemy force. Fall back to Marine HQ. I say again, fall back to Marine HQ and await further orders. Leaders give Zimrat. Over. Command HQ, this is Bravo Team. We've got one Marine down, two wounded. Command HQ, this is Fire Team 4. We are pinned down and outplanned. Command HQ, this is Fire Team 2. Main power systems down and up. Back up the systems only. We've got lots of civilian casualties. It's a mess. Command HQ, attempting to secure the area. This is the audio log of Frank Delahue, engineering manager of Santa Power Production, dated October 18, 2145. The current operational status of the grid is 23% over nominal capacity. Shifts to 12 hours a day for all personnel. The constant and increasing load from the Delta complex is causing havoc. We are going to start losing critical systems if we have to sustain these levels much longer. I request clearance to requisition parts from other departments in order to maintain our equipment. Okay, I don't know what is going on over at Delta, but I'm doing all I can down here. The constant demands are bad enough that the rumors are around and making things a whole lot worse. And I gotta tell you, things don't get better soon. All hell is gonna get worse. This is the audio log of Frank Delahue, engineering manager assigned to power production, dated October 24th, 2145. Reclamation problems continue to plague the main process. Two more valve overloads are not in just the past week. 
These overloads can destroy the valves, causing a very dangerous fire, jumping with enough heat to incinerate sensitive equipment nearby. Today, we've had only one reported injury as a result of these valve failures. And this is due in large part to the quick response of the engine team. Our procedure has been a failure for the two, and the operation terminal has proved adequate, and I recommend no changes in that procedure. and set up a CP there. Out.
This is Sergeant Kelly. Fall back to Marine HQ and await further orders. 